And welcome back. Well, summer is here. Time to kick back and enjoy all the wonderful things Wisconsin has to offer. But our next guest, next guest says, uh, 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 not so fast. Tim is back with Vert's Marketing Small Business Monday, and he says summer is the time to stay ahead of the competition, not kick back and relax in the boat, Tim. Well, maybe a little bit. <laughs> all right, but you, here's the deal. This is your time that you have to plan well, right? right? Well, I think too often you have, might have big projects coming up mm -hmm. and you think, wow, there's people on vacation, it's nice out, I wanna go to Summerfest an extra few days, but you need to kind of really be prepared yes. and not waste the summer months because before you know it, it's gonna be September. And what we really need to think about is just in a week and a half, half the year's done. It's so true. I think that's the shock to people here right. is to think that, you know, as we start thinking about how have we been performing in the beginning of the year, well, we really need to take note because sure. it's halfway over. Right. And so what do you want to change for the rest of 2018 is your next topic. You need to really kind of focus on this next portion. Right, right. So you want to evaluate, okay, what went well, what didn't go well, what do I want to change? It's kind of halftime. Yeah. So you got to, you know, figure it out. All right, what's going on? What do I need to adjust? And I wouldn't wait until September, until the summer's over, because by then you only have a few months left in the year. Now's the time that you really want to kind of take stock of that and make those changes. Are there sales strategies that need to be improved? Are there marketing strategies, such as calling Vert's Marketing, for yeah. example? Uh, you know, what needs to be done to really make sure you have a great year. I bet this time of year you do get a lot of calls, people saying, well, I tried to do this all on my own this year. Sure. I thought I could just do this right. or just kind of push it out on social media. And they don't realize all the things that you can do, you know, and it really does make a huge difference when you use a professional. They're probably looking at those bottom lines saying, okay, ha the first half didn't go as well. I need to make adjustments. Like you said, write it down, put deadlines down on responsibilities and things. And you say summer is a great time to reward and motivate employees and sure. that's something people can do right now right we're just, we're basically at full employment mm -hmm. the, the last time we were on we talked about how it's really hard to recruit employees right now yes well the employees you have you make sure you love them mm -hmm. uh, make sure you take care of them does that mean giving dollar bonuses well, what does that mean I think a lot of times what they like especially in the summer give them some tickets to Summerfest yes give them tickets to a concert have an afternoon and everyone go to a brewer game. You can certainly take some time off, but you want to reward, you want to motivate your employees. That's going to go a lot longer than saying, okay, here's a little bit of an extra bonus. They're going to remember those good times that you have, and, and it's a good bonding experience for your employees as well. When you do that, you know, say you get tickets to um, the Brewers or the Chinooks or whatever is around, right? You do, do you talk business at those events or do you yeah. really let it go for the day? I, I think you can maybe a little bit, okay. but you're there to reward them, have yeah. a good time. Maybe there's people that don't know each other so well, but they work together all the time, and now there's a time they can see themselves in a different setting. And now's a good time to contact you. You're not too busy where you can still take on some new people? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, because yeah. I think the big thing is, is understanding your digital marketing strategy, and that's right. what you guys do. You get people on board, doing it the right way, so the rest of the year is like up and up. Yeah, exactly. It's great. So here's how you can contact Tim and his great crew over at Vert's Marketing. You're in Mequon and the Third Ward, 262-910-4125 for vertsmarketing.com. Remember, we're halfway through 2018. What do you need to reevaluate? My guess is your digital marketing. <laughs> Thanks, right. Tim. Thank you. All right.